everybody, our fairy here. Wanted to share our amazing Teeswater locks with you. This is for the uh, felted shawl, I think I called it. Felted shawl, felted curly, curly locks, felted shawl. It's a pattern that's available and we have videos on how to do it. And you get this amazing mass of Teeswater and then you felt it to a bat, which I have dyed and it's Sorry about the finger. I'm trying to learn to go sideways for y'all so you can actually see what I'm doing. Um, yeah, so you felt it to the bat, and then you're done. It's like done. I mean, it, and talk about getting your aggression out. You just sit there pounding on this uh, bat with a brush and needles, and before you know it, you're like, ha, oh, life is good. Okay, <laughs> so the other thing we have today is like these 20-inch long locks. You amazing. You just, you just, diva, talk about a diva walking down the street in this sucker. Um, yeah, super long locks. They could be turned into dreads or something too. We still have lots of these and we can do them up in any color. So if anybody's interested, PM me. Yarn Fairy one at mm, gmail.com. <laughs> yeah, I'll get it. And then we also have um, hand painted gradients. Uh, where you take uh, and make a bunch of locks in one group and then you paint them, you know, dark to light, light to dark, however you want to do it. I've got some oil slick and some other tiny locks and uh, like a turquoisey black color. And I've got rainbows of this stuff, you guys. If you, anybody wants anything, just holler because that's what I do.